All right, ladies and gentlemen, the first thing I'm going to do is I'll just go to date and time so that you can see when this was video recorded. This is going to be posted online and it's going to be used as a future proof because I was warned by the journalists that the stuff that I post already in 2015 2017 and so on the stuff that I post is of critical nature because it points out where the whole thing is going and it's undeniably real because it's the first hand information I have and so the first thing we're gonna take is the date and time however they told me unfortunately go and you edit your stuff and what the blogger does blogger doesn't state here you know edit it let's say uh, on such and such day right I don't even know where it says that it should it should display that it was edited or something like this I don't know they told me about such an issue that I edit the stuff update the stuff and it doesn't matter if I update one within two three days or whatever it is the case it does have a heavy impact on years to come issues for which unfortunately they cannot go and evoke the information from this new site because they wanted to cite my new site uh, and cite that I did already procrastinate it in the future uh, incursions the future conflicts around the world whatever is happening and so what I came to conclusion is to protect my information because it's too much information like this that went by and I got no credit for it to video record this stuff for the sake of the proof so post this online in video package so that journalists actually can go and can a resort to this information as information that was credible that was good information that was given first-hand dependable information that can and should be used in a media against politicians and so in this post right here which I posted today on Monday March 21st 2022 just as it states here Monday 21st of 222 I explained in details all about situation in this world about China made products Russian related to Russian I wouldn't call this incursion I wouldn't call this Um, it's attack it's invasion it's a massacre it's a slaughter against people of Ukraine which in this case however was not even started by the Russia this stuff was eventually started by China To be more precise about it it was started by both countries which have committed themselves to a global some people refer to it as a new world order I don't think this is any kind of order in this case we have China and Russia which did defended their existence during the World War II against Hitler and others who assisted Hitler to engage in these exactly same methods that Hitler used, Mussolini used on others during the World War II. Thus, we cannot talk about any communism in China. But since one's, one is completely indifferent from acts in completely in different ways against the Uyghur people, Uyghur people are half European people, Muslims 
of Turkish descent. These are Turks, basically. Against people of Taiwan. In exactly the same fashion as Adolf Hitler did on countries neighboring Germany. So just because they have a seagull and hammer and red flag, that doesn't mean that they too cannot find themselves and should be charged with the same war crimes as the Nazi Germany was. And it goes likewise to Russia, which turned further into Soviet Iron Curtain under Stalin and so on against the rest of Eastern Europe. And I wouldn't even say against their own Russian people because I see that this Russian legacy, so much, this Soviet legacy in the Russian people, so much is alive, so much survived. It is something unbelievable. That's why this video. Because of the people that congregated in this very city, in the city of the Novo Mesto in Slovenia, If I briefly demonstrate what Slovenia is, Slovenia is a little country, tiny little country. This is my birth city, a city of the novel myth in Slovenia. Right next to Austria on the north, east, Hungary, Croatia, east, south, and on the west we have a border with uh, Italy. This is where Slovenia is. And as this is, sorry, this is a map in Slovenian language, but I'm sure you can relate to its position. If you look at the Austria, we are right south of the Austria and east of Italy. This is where all the important people interested in what you guys refer to as a new world order used together. In this very city, we also have a company known as a Kirka Pharmaceutical. And this Kirka Pharmaceutical, just as I have pointed out, this Kirka Pharmaceutical, just as I have pointed out in this post, did a whole a lot of evil to the people of Ukraine. It's not only about the people to Ukraine that this company did, I was one of the people who paid the highest price. I'm a native Slovenian for what the two directors of this company, one is Jozef Solaric and the other one was already passed away, Miloš Kovacic, have obligated themselves to, on behalf of Milan Kuchan, on behalf of Borut Pahar. These are the remnants a people who demanded from our people to lay down weapons in front of the Serbian aggressor, which acted in Slovenia, Croatia, Bosnia, in exactly the same fashion as the Russians act today in Ukraine against the Ukrainian people. This is the Udba individual. Funny enough, we do have this, his apprentice, this individual here now as a president in Slovenia, and this is bizarre as it gets, but it's not so bizarre. The people that who are meeting here inside of this house, inside of this house here in this little city of the Novo Mesto, this people here, this, therefore all the evil everything the world have ever seen that was interested, that was stimulated in reviving old colonization of this world. And for that matter to be accomplished, China and Russia have to be dragged in this war. Mother of all wars, you probably guys, the best will be to refer one as World War Three. Asia, Africa, 
South America, you name it. This is what this is. And to get these two countries going, they had to get their part. And now you're talking about the Uyghurs, you're talking about the Taiwan. They did talk about the Philippines too. They talk about, of course, Ukraine, Slovenia, on how they're going to divide, on how they will get whatever they want once their legacy is fulfilled. It will be a time for the old countries, colonial states, to take over this game. And then, on one side, China and Russia. On the other hand, Western Europe, if you like, with the chicken states, such as Poland, Czech Republic, Slovakia, Romania, Hungary, whatever is going to le be left out of Ukraine, are going to march along toward their legacy into what I see is a path to nowhere. That's pretty much the way I see it. Because the only thing that's going to happen is they're going to reduce us one by one into nothing, just like they did with Ukraine. For this crime, to be even more deterrent against me, especially myself, because I knew about this stuff. They wanted me as a proof. I would be drugged up, driven around, taken around by the both directors of Novo Mesto Police Department, of which one right now, Olai is his name, he became director of the police in Novo Mesto. They did so to terrorize locals so that locals, the only thing they would do is they would really act like a chickens. Oh, I know you, I recognize you. Uh, tra la 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 la, you are such and such and such. And the only answer I get is, how do you know? Uh, well, I know because you are a chicken shit. That's why the hell I know. I know that you are a chicken shit because of your image of me right next to police director, present police director of Novo Mesto, Ogulinianis, and what became once fired from official duties due to crime involvement, but instead got promoted into director of Slovenian police, Anton Olai. So I know that you definitely are a chicken shit. And when I am identifying your chicken shit, I'm doing a dead favor to myself, who really was deprived of everything, so you can have your materialistic goodies and betray more. So you can betray more so that Germans, French, Britons, Americans can see themselves more and more and more in Vladimir Putin in China fascist China that's why you are a chicken shit next to all the crime you did against me for the sake of your jobs promotions loans and so on and so forth these people these two people here from Kirka Pharmaceutical, these people, in fact, conditioned not only to me but to other people with their investments straight into Russia and China, uh, Serbia. Serbia was first on the map, then Russia came. Have investments in return for sold shares in Africa where they also participated in the pharmaceutical market. With jobs, if you don't see, because they claim these are our main markets, are Russia and Serbia, so if you don't see the Serbian or the Russian way, you are listed as good as dead, jobless and also destroyed. 
This is the politic. This is the political terms they set. I would love to resort with this statement only against Slovenia, which shouldn't be inside of the European Union if the European Union consider itself as a civilized society in the first place. I'm not sure about it because my complaints reached on a deaf ears of the European Union court officials, government officials, and all the people, as I stated, which appear do have enough strength to guide all this into, into their road toward nowhere. That's why I mentioned here also Germany, which heavily invested in China. Unfortunately, it wasn't only Slovenia that did this stuff. So all the stuff that we see now, whatever we see now, and you see, you see this people like this guy here, Schwarzenegger. Everybody, so you know, praised, you know, it's so praised. This speech that he made is so praised. You know, and it really is a great, great speech. He imitated actually Babushka, a grandma, a Russian grandma. He told me he will do it. This guy is an actor. He will do so to, get, to gain as much as confidence as possible. But not to stop the war, but to camouflage this war. You understand? To make this war as much as invisible as the war from the both sides against Ukraine as possible. He talks about the good Russians. He talks about the Yuri Vlasov and stuff like this. Yuri Vlasov was involved in MK Ultra because of this guy since '95. I don't know. Was it because of this guy? Was it because of? Почему вы жертвуете этими молодыми людьми? Was it because of this guy? Was it because of uh, some other politicians? This individual conditioned me in the same fashion just as Vladimir Putin did, just as his henchmen did. Either you're going to comply or you're dead. I will recognize you, he stated me, if you will comply with the Putin. And I did not comply with the Putin for what he told me that if you will not comply with the Putin, I will disappear. And he did so. His arbitrary dates to 2021. He first mentioned they're going to make me disappear, but he was more and more um, insisting on how he will disappear, that he doesn't want to be part of it, and I don't know what, and this and that and that. Okay, That much about Arnold Schwarzenegger is this individual here. Arnold Schwarzenegger made me come to Moscow and suburbs, Moscow suburbs, and we would travel from to many locations. Arnold Schwarzenegger felt that having me next to him also had his son would contribute to his safety, I think, because I think he did felt much more confident having me next to him because I was a, such a big case. For his own safety, for his own ass, he did use this issue everywhere he went. And so, and no wonder we would be meeting some babushka and he would be talking to her and practice even with her the speech about 10 years ago in 2010, knowing about the war coming to Ukraine. And so identical to his views, which are just nothing other than words. They're nothing other than words. These people only look for financial interests and foremost, they're looking for what I have already stated to you here. Interests of what you guys refer to as a new world order. You also have a whole bunch of people involved that are Russian people that are involved in this case and with whom I was conditioned my life if you're not going to recognize her, if you're not going to do this, they figured out that I want a blonde woman no matter what. And the only blonde women that would I would be allowed to date would be a Russian, with a Russian features, blonde or nothing. This is the way it was. 
and so I know that because it's a blonde about this blonde and it, they, they really let's say publicize but they really push forward they really accent they really emphasize they they're really trying to make sensation out of this blunt you know blunt they're pushing this shit everywhere i know what blunt means i know where blunt goes i know i know where this shit is going i know who is behind this shit i know this little shit here that blocked me that took deprived me 27 years of life that hijacked me on whose behalf they hijacked me from the US and brought me for beatings to Russia, to Poland, to other countries, to China. And one cash through the beatings became wealthy and is never satisfied because wants always more and more and more. I know who is this shit behind this crap, behind these good Russians, behind these friends of Arnold Schwarzenegger. I know who is the one who is cashing. I know who is the one who is going to demand more crime against me, more abuse against me, conditioning me more life. I'm half a century old. I know who is this shit doing this stuff. I know why European Union is diving into hell. It's not the first time. Based on what I have seen from the good Russians, as they refer themselves to, and the media is publicizing this good Russians, the only thing I'm going to tell you is that their contribution, their real contribution to stop the war in Ukraine, when I consider these people knew 15 years ahead, at least all these people that you see today that protest, that you see in the media, and I was all over the Russia. I alone end up in 2017, just as I have explained pushing forward war against Ukraine inside of the Russia. It was a really, really stark contrast to what Vladimir Putin claimed that he's going to brainwash a Russian troops, he's going to brainwash Russian troops against Ukraine based on my Nazi statements that I'm Nazi and that's how he's going to brainwash Russian soldiers against Ukraine on Ukraine that's how he's going to unleash them and how he's going to prove then that Ukrainians in fact are Nazis just like I am yes he was using me through the Buckingham Palace. They would bring me with the journalists to Ukraine. And they would try to catch Ukrainian politicians and get them in acts with pants down. It would be enough if they would say yes. That I would make some kind of Nazi statement. And I would say yes. And they would get them. And it would be the proofs they would send straight to Moscow on planes as soon as I would arrive from such operations I would go with the proofs right on the plane and with this proofs I would send I would land right in the Moscow airport from London to Moscow that's where they would, the Russians would collect and they would gather these cases and this is how the Russians based in this war but in 2017 I was all over Moscow publicly inciting Russian people literally pushing for war against Ukraine which is explained right here so good luck with those tapes with which Vladimir Putin who accomplished my neo-nazi status under MK Ultra by beatings in front of memorials partisan memorials in Slovenia I was hijacked from Miami by the CIA and brought to Slovenia 11 and a half years repeatedly without ever coming to Europe in real time. Beaten up in front of the memorials dedicated to the partisans and accused to be Nazi. And told that with the beatings, with such a severity, it will even make a difference whether 
I was or I was not Nazi because these beatings eventually are going to accomplish that I will see myself as a Nazi based on so many betrayals based on my being taken through the villages of Slovenia through the locality of Novo Mesto and throughout entire Slovenia thanks to the chickens this became a reality because so many chickens betrayed me that I started due to abuse even believed that World War II did not end this is how severe this abuse was this is how Vladimir Putin accomplished in 2017 however he accomplished that I was marching through Ukraine together with the Buckingham Palace with the London and with the Canadians parade through the Moscow and incited in war against Ukraine which also I understand was video recorded and even Ukrainians got the proofs about this one not only Americans not only Russians so when you tell me about this good Russians who knew about all this stuff 15 years ahead this crowd that you see here possibly even 20 years ahead and have done just like Arnold Schwarzenegger who parades today and talk the, gives the words of wisdom to the world he shares the words of wisdom to the world is really smoothing his talk I'll tell you that he is smooth he replicated this babushka like something unbelievable I can say their contribution to the peace of this world is zero it's none I would say that just like MiG airplanes just like older generation the MiG airplanes which Vladimir Putin told me is going to use so that he can demonstrate the loss in Ukraine that's what he stated me it's going to be no Armada tanks and it's going to be no SU uh, the newest planes and stuff like this it's just going to be this old planes that, gonna, that he's going to unleash old tanks so that he can demonstrate that Ukraine actually it was a big fight he is sending this Russian guys into death basically he knows that he's sending this into into a death but we'll use the most modern planes we use the most modern tanks the most modern equipment in case of the backup and even more so with the China in a territory of Africa of African continent in the Middle East this is actually his plan the plan what I stated right now matches the information which I stated earlier about German Franco British American conquest of Middle East Africa on one side China and Russia and on the other side you have chicken states with whatever I stated right now Zircon missiles I wouldn't even believe the information I was told I wouldn't even believe the information I was told but I was told that when you're gonna mention London you're gonna see just how many people are gonna come to your website this was Prince Harry who told me however this is listed here a Russian threat from the White Sea with the Zircon hypersonic missiles for which Vladimir Putin stated I don't know how many how fast those missiles are however for which none no proof exists these missiles actually exist from what they are launching them there is nothing really that can be said it can be determined the speed and even the videos can be manipulated Prince Harry alone stated if somehow you will not get those missiles done by stage when we're gonna justify our 
uninvolvement, us not getting involved in a in a conflict, we're gonna give you these missiles, or we're gonna we're gonna borrow them, or we're gonna orchestrate whatever we're gonna do to prove, in a parenthesis, to prove that you did have these missiles, so that it was for us impossible to get involved. This is basically how far this shit Ukrainian war is going. And for me, the most important, ladies and gentlemen, in this case, as I stated, is the date and time. So that you journalists around the world, when this shit is going to happen, it's going to be another. It's going to be another big news today that's going to come out. Again, look. I'm going to update the date and time. March 21st, 2022. It's going to be another big news today that's going to come out. And based on this news here, it's going to be a meeting today. I'm going to update this on the website, or maybe not. I don't know what's going to happen, but it really depends on the outcome of this meeting. Because this is a very, very important news that again implies this so-called new world order and I'm not going to stand by and watch world go to hell because of some special people, interests who didn't have not only any kind of mercy for me but they really have no mercy for anybody they're not sparing anybody, really so that's all I wanted to clarify for this video that you can Rest assured that this was a video posted on today's date on a March 21st, 2022 by my news site. And so that when you see this, that you know that just like Benjamin Netanyahu, ex-Prime Minister of Israel, stated, they had everything on a plate right in front of them and they didn't believe. And he was keep laughing and referring to me. And they just didn't believe. They just didn't believe. They just will not believe. You know, this is how the whole thing is going. And you're going to see if this is going to happen or not. Thanks for watching this video. I do have to... As I stated... protect my own sanity because I don't need no any Russian blondes and I don't need to fuck myself split myself on a good and evil Russians because in this case as I stated it's not only Russians but it's all the shit it's all calculated to the losses the Ukrainian military suffers Ukrainian people suffer yeah that's how they get approved eight packages from the west that's how they give them they lose so much and so much and they get another approval and this and that the guys act tough but never nothing comes out of it just to make sure that i don't actually i want to keep mental fitness straight i don't want to get into bullshit i don't want to get into schizoia schizophrenia they insist on they brainwash on good and bad and this and that and at the same time they haven't done absolutely anything to stop this war they actually even haggle twist about what a ukraine should be or should not be inside of the european union with the chinese taking side literally with the chinese taking side repeating Vladimir Putin is language about denazifying Ukraine. About denazifying Ukraine while having their own journalists literally march in Ukraine and call for the genocide. That is actually unheard of. We haven't seen anything like this. Maybe we have seen something like this in the World War II an axis of evil and that's why I said nobody's gonna convince me that this is a communism nobody's gonna convince me that this is 
they're doing this to defend the world or that they have the right to act in this way. They act this way exactly because they don't have the right to act this way. calling even sanctions which do nothing in respect to what we see is taking place city with a 450,000 residents is nixed is deleted into a dust this could be a city many countries would consider as a as a easily could consider it a capital Nixed, zeroed. And repeat after the Russia denazification of Ukraine, where it's where the slaughter like this is taking place. Yep colony can be China and trust me the West is not doing I'm not gonna say enough to stop this but they are in complete agreement with one another so you're gonna see what this is gonna be Taiwan is an F is an next freebie for China not only Uyghur people not only half European Turkish Uyghur people but Taiwan is an X freebie and so that's exactly why Germany invested in this stuff. 